What's up guys? Happy Friday. I am going Blu-ray hunting strictly at Dollar General today. We still have some electricity down and wires and people still don't have power four days later. Not me, thank God. But I just need to get out of the house. So I am off to see what I can find out there at Dollar General and to show you guys what great things that you can find. So let's go. All right, going into our first location of the Dollar General. This is where I found all of those steel books and Blu-rays before, so I'm looking forward. Right when you enter is where they are. So let's check it out. All right. There's the bin of everything. Looks like DVDs are mixed in. Camelot. This is every day. Is that a good one in here? Uh, Not a good I, one. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Someone decided to interrupt me. So now I'm at a different Blu ray section. We have Johnny English Reborn, $3.95. Life as we know it. Son of Kong for $3.95. I don't think I've ever seen that out, so that's pretty good. Amelia, Hilary Swank, and is that Richard Gere? I think so. Rocky V, Jodie Foster, The Brave One, Crazy Stupid Love Again, this is where I found that here. Steven Seagal, Out for Justice. Conan the Destroyer, Something Borrowed, Conan Again. They have some pretty decent selections here. What is this? Strange, strange brew. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Um, let's see, what's this one? In a, in a something of violence. In a valley of violence. Never heard of that, but Ethan Hawk is in it. Chips. The angle is bad, I'm sorry guys, and it's moving. Clash of the Titans, Boiler Room. What? They have Porky's? Oh my god, this is really going back. Porky's on Blu-ray, $3.95, not getting it though. The Avengers, not my Avengers, The Avengers with Ralph Fiennes and Uma Thurman. Midnight Special. I think I heard stuff about this. Let me know if this is good. I might end up getting that. The Flintstones. Now we have Rocky 2 and Rocky Balboa. If you guys don't have Rocky, you can get the whole collection at Dollar General. The Born Supremacy. All about Steve. This is probably one of Sandra Bullock's worst movies ever. I have seen this. It is pretty bad. Rising Sun. We have the first Sex in the City, Valentine's Day, Meet the, Meet the Spartans, Red Dawn, the remake, not the original. Yeah, they got some new ones since the last time I was in here. 007, License to Kill, Sea Biscuit, not bad. Rockstar, Rock of Ages, Walter Mitty, it's always in there. Turn it around here, see what we got on the other side. All right, Jackie Chan's first strike. What is this, the Hinden? The Hindenburg. Where the room again. Contagion. This is our lives right now, Contagion. Point Break. Cool. A Perfect Murder. Wow. They really have some, some different ones that I might be interested in getting. Mental Guidance. Stoker. I don't even know what that is, but is that Nicole Kidman? Hangover Part 3, Joy. City Heat. The Deep End. Ooh, what's that? Blade 2. Oh, I see a steel book. Clash of the Titans steelbook. Interesting. The Sentinel. 
Oh, I might get this one. Michael Douglas. I think I heard things about this one. That's a possibility. License to wed. He's just not that into you. Anna Karenina. Wow. They really do have a big variety of what they have. Won't back down. Ninja Turtles. Meet the Fockers. Wall Street Money Never Sleeps. Spark something. Sparkle. Sparkle. Never heard of that one. More John Wayne. Yeah, they got a lot of stuff at this one, so I have to do some choosing because I think there's stuff that I want to get here. When you're filming, you never know what is going to happen. I walked in and two seconds after I started going through what they had available, someone starts talking to me. That's usually what happens when I'm out Blu-ray hunting and I try to ignore it, but then he started asking me questions. So we got a couple things, but we're not done yet. We're still continuing our journey, so on to the next. Here we are at location number two, and uh, it looks like this is it. <laughs> this is it, this is all we have. I'm not really sure if this is even worth looking at. We have a double of the blind side and dolphin tail, but I already have the blind side and I have no interest in dolphin tail, so that's a no. I'm only going for Blu-rays, so this mostly looks like DVDs. Although you guys can kind of see that they do have pretty good DVD options for cheap, but I'm not seeing any Blu-rays. Lord of the Rings, but not interested. Yeah, there really isn't a lot of Blu-ray choices, so. I'm sorry, miss. It's okay. Sorry. So, yeah. Yeah, on to the next location. Third location of the day. I've never been to this one, so let's stay optimistic. Hopefully I can find something great. So I thought I was done showing you guys stuff, but as I was looking, I came across all of these red packages, and I've never seen this before at Dollar General ever, and these are actually complete seasons of shows for one dollar. That's why they're called Treasure Hunt. I guess the box must have been damaged or something, and they just took out the the disc and put them in these packages look they have 30 rock the complete season of the fourth fourth season and they have leverage and dexter the complete fourth season for one dollar i mean granted you're getting all random seasons but if you need them who cares this is the complete second season of lost they have vampire diaries the complete second season. This is crazy. I've never seen anything like this before. Homeland, How I Met Your Mother, Lost Again. They have Ally McBeal. Like, this is crazy. And then also, the same thing with movies. Like, I guess the movie packages were damaged and they're selling movies for a dollar. And they have it as a treasure hunt. So that's pretty cool. I've never seen anything like that here at Dollar General. And then also, I came across these movie collections. They have the John Wayne collection. They also have a collection for Liam Neeson of about 10 of their movies for 20 bucks or $25, which, of course, I'm not going to pay for that, but that's pretty cool. That'd be a great gift for somebody. So just a little extra about your local Dollar General. They might have stuff like this. All right, guys, back at home. Sometimes you win some and you lose some. And I think this video is a definite example of that. I found some items at one Dollar General and the others, not so much. However, I hope I showed you that you can get some great movies for a low price. So let me show you what I did pick up today. First, we'll start with every day. I got this for $1.95. I heard about this one, I believe, when it first came out, but it's one of those movies that hit theaters. It didn't really do all that well at the box office and kind of just went away very quickly. But for $1.95, I'm open to it. Someone's contacting me on my iPad. That's what that little ding was. Okay, let's move on to The Sentinel. I did wind up getting The Sentinel with Michael Douglas, $3.95. I like Michael Douglas and Kiefer Sutherland. For the price, you really can't beat it. And then I think today was a Michael Douglas day because I wound up getting A Perfect Murder as well with Gwyneth Paltrow and Viggo Mortensen, a very young Viggo Mortensen. This movie is old. I know it's very, very old, but um, 
yeah, I just, random pickups, random pickups today. I know they're not the most trendy pickups, but for the price of $3.95 to build the collection, you really can't go wrong. And then finally, I did wind up getting Midnight Special. For some reason, I think I've heard great things about this from different sources. So if this is really good, I didn't want to miss out on it. It was the only one there that was available. So I went ahead and picked this up. But the big question is, what did you guys pick up this week if you picked up anything at all? Tomorrow, I think I'm going to FYE in the mall. You know I dread going to the mall. But for Funkos and Blu-rays... I will go anywhere. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.